Hey Sean, this is a buffalo made mustard I eat on my sandwiches and dip rolled gold pretzels in it. Well, I like pretzels. But. Globby bites and hashtag don't forget to bring a towel. Generous gift from the one and only Michael Goodrich. 1922. I've got just the food for this mustard. This worked out very well today. Nobody cares, Sean. Oh, oh my god. It's, the <laughs> it's what I had as a kid. Nobody cares. It's the exact thing that I was talking about. Are you kidding me? Who's that from? I think somebody bought it off of like eBay or Etsy. Who's this from? Are there two? Can I get one? There's two. This is it. Like this is the exact one. I cannot wait to text my parents. And then here's Allie's. She got one too. These are so good for soups obviously. You'll get nothing and like it. Alright, whoever sent these, that is the sweetest thing. Oh my god, look, it really is. It's the 1994 trademark. This is the exact one. Wow. I can't believe I'm saying this. I wish it was still winter. God, I love these. I haven't had a super pretzel in pff, 20 years. But on pretzel day, well, I like pretzel day. Oh, you guys, welcome back to the vlog. These people, the Roy Boyle Fan Club, they made this one possible here today. Thank you so much for that. Click you off, and let's open the box. The super pretzel. Today they were on sale. This box was $2.50. Six pretzels. This box looks unchanged, I believe. This was responsible for my immediate obsession with soft pretzels. My parents would buy these and we would have them all the time. The salt packet that you have to open and then close and then keep because you're not going to eat me all six of them. Oh yeah. We'll make two. Classic. Are these gonna be as good as the Bavarian soft pretzel I had a couple weeks ago? No, but in a pinch, come on. And then obviously I unboxed this yesterday. You saw that earlier in the video. Mm-hmm. J and J Snack Foods Corporation in Mount Laurel, Laurel, New Jersey. Conventional and toaster oven instructions, air fryer nowadays, and microwave. Because this is nostalgia kitchen on this vlog, I'm gonna do conventional oven, because that's what I used to do. I cannot stress to you guys enough how excited I was to do this for the show because I've thought about doing it forever. These were just one of the staples of my childhood and I never buy them anymore. I don't know why. I don't. <laughs> so you kind of give this a little dampening, just enough so the salt will stick to it. So much of it falls. As always, while you watch videos like this, let me know if you guys had an affinity for these two. There you go. Just how my mom and pa used to do it. And we're gonna throw these in for like four minutes. As those are baking, let's go ahead and try this mustard. Beautiful yellow. Make ourselves a dipping cup for when the pretzels are done. How are we tasting? Oh, oh yeah. Wow, you get hit with the yellow mustard very hard up front. Super tangy, creamy punch. And the horseradish kind of like at the end kind of sails in. Well, I guess it's official. That's full bodied right there. Webbers. What's going on with this? Facebook, a life with a purpose. If you're on Facebook too much, you don't have a purpose. <laughs> well. But enough with the fun and games. It's time for everyone's favorite. Work. We are done. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's late. Our day is almost over. It's time to go. Alright, you wanna eat these when they're piping hot. Experience is just heightened. I wanna do it as is for that nostalgic hit, then we'll get into some mustard. It's the most basic pretzel, but ma'am. 
We're all about nostalgic vibes on this channel. We hit it. I know so many of you grew up on these two, and it is just a vibe unlike any other. Mmm, Michael, this mustard is great. It hit me too. <laughs> Go clearing the sinuses. Mmm, it's just fantastic. It's simple, easy. The fact you can air fry them now. It's not trying to be the best pretzel ever made. The same soft, warm, and delicious super pretzel you enjoy at the game, you can also have at home. Available in your grocer's freezer. I know. Super pretzel, bring it home. Oh, I brought it home, baby. Damn, Super Pretzel's YouTube channel's got some production value. Just because you know I love history of brands like this. Super Pretzel, 1971, Jerry Schreiber bought a struggling pretzel company in bankruptcy court for 70 grand, and his plan was to market soft pretzels to sports stadiums, which at the time had a limited menu, to build a display case, use metal hooks arranged in the shape of a tree in a glass, and he coined the term Super Pretzel due to his love of Superman. And now for, what, 53 years? They're still killing it. That mustard is so good. It really does clean out your sinuses. Oh my god. This was very much like my brother and I playing video games downstairs in our Michigan basement. And my mom would bring down a few of these. Oh, or like we'd come in from playing basketball outside and my dad would have them ready. Bang up job, parents. Honestly, like decently fluffy in there. The ones you get at sports stadiums are frozen. So this isn't far off. And truly, soft pretzel is one of the most aesthetically pleasing foods, I feel like. It's just, it's just gorgeous. I'm gonna eat you now. Come here, I'm gonna eat you! Mm. Snacks for smiles all around. One pretzel, 160 calories. All right, I won't hold you guys up. Even the smell of these cooking brought back so many memories. Globby Bites. Just because I have it, I want to try Coleman's, which is really intense on this too. I love you, Super Pretzel. Thanks for existing. These mustards will mess you up. <laughs> Feel high. What? You're a moron! Coleman's in the Weber's. Oh, I can breathe all the way to Gary, Indiana. What? Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, I feel like I just rubbed vapor rub on my nose. Well, dish duty today was extremely simple. You love to see it. Alright, guys, well, super pretzel of the final four, you know? The Venmo, the PayPal, the Cash App, if you want to support the vlog, if there's something nostalgic you loved as a kid, you want to see me eat, I will. Here is the address on screen to send me things just like Michael did and a reveal that I found out via email, Andy who sent me that seafood a long time ago has been an awesome Rory Boyle fan club member. Andy sent those Campbell soup mugs, legendary. I love you guys. Thank you for understanding nostalgic foods and kitchens and relationships with grandparents and making all that stuff, thank you. Two super pretzels up, two super pretzels down. It's easy to be good to each other when you can just buy a frozen box of pretzels and you're happy. <laughs> be good to each other. Monday morning. I open my eyes And I'm greeted by a cute little smile The world is new With you by my side Everything is beautiful Tuesday afternoon I'm calling you home Just to hear your voice on the Oh, I like pretzels. I am totally gonna bang Holly. Tombstone Most Hops some late night editing, a late night beer. All thanks to Mr. Nathan Peterson sending these from Arizona. That's milky. 8.5% Tombstone, Arizona. Keep cold, drink fresh. I know. <laughs> How are you? Cheers. Oh yeah. Is it the burrito? Is it the quesadilla? Is it the soft taco not crispy? Or is it the bowl? Ple I hate my voice. I love that beer. I hate which seems counterintuitive because I, you get it. Nathan, these are quality. Thank you.